What's up, everybody? Nate List from BreakoutFinder.com here. Listen, we are so close to the NFL Combine and seeing the wideouts test that I can taste it. The anticipation of projecting a 40-yard dash time for a wide receiver and then completely whiffing it by a full half second? Oh, buddy, I live for this. But in my guy Kelvin Harmon's case, I feel confident taking a crack at it. Call it insider trading information. Call it level 7 clearance stuff. Either way, I feel confident in telling you that Kelvin Harmon will run a 4-5-5 at the NFL Combine. Now some of you are probably like, yeah, yeah, Nate, we already know. But I actually don't believe that this is the vast majority of people. You see, I believe the vast majority of people believe that Kelvin Harmon will run a 4-6 or a 4-7 at the NFL Combine. But at 6 foot 2 and 220 20 plus pounds, a 455 is plenty fast enough. And I'm so excited to see it happen that I'm doing this. How old is Ric Flair? Is he like 117 years old now? I'm gonna break his bone. Oh, he's gone. Listen, guys. If this is your first encounter with Kelvin Harmon, welcome. Because he showed up on the radar as a freshman. You just really had to dig to find him. As a sophomore posting 69 catches for over 1,000 yards, he was certainly on the radar. And after completing this year with 80 catches for over 1,100 yards, Kelvin Harmon vaulted himself arguably into the first round conversation for wide receivers in this class. And this is the class of alpha wide receivers. We've been saying it for over a year. And Kelvin Harmon is just about as close to the top of it as you possibly get. But I'll do one better. I'll make one more prediction for Kelvin Harmon at the Combine. I believe that Kelvin Harmon will test with one of the faster pro agility times of the day. His 20-yard shuttle, I believe, will be in the low fours. So after Saturday ends and the dust settles, I think all of us will be in line with the feeling of Ric Flair in this clip right here. I'm just gonna let it ride out with Rick, the damn legend. He's 180 years old.